Welcome back, and as soon as I was start to, about to start this video, I got a giant. That's pretty cool. I'll take it. That's my eighth giant. So, um, yeah. Today's video is going to be going over the um, quest runes. Now, um, real quick, I think at the beginning of all my videos, I'm going to go over um, just where I'm at real quick. So right now, eight giants, um, 372 metallic score. Here's my shiny score. I'm gonna kind of just do this at the beginning of every my, all my videos, and then go over just like one special thing that's happened to me recently, um, and that was uh, for this video is my 10k or 10 million pet score um, achieved. So got the mythical pet collector there. I'm just missing the quest one, the rebirth one, and then. Uh, metallics and below with the giants and the shiny giants but anyways today we're going over this um, which this is not even open um, and we're kind of just uh, well first of all I'm going to tell you how to get these <coughs> um, it's pretty simple pretty straightforward um, all you have to do is unlock the grove now once you unlock the grove most of the time it's going to give you just these like little quest I have right now it's just going to tell you it's going to give you money but eventually, you have a small, small chance of eventually getting um, a quest where it's going to give you these runes as the reward instead. So, um, just keep on trying to get your quests done, um, grind it out, and eventually they'll stop pop, start popping up and you can start upgrading these, um, these wall upgrades. Um, I'm going to kind of go over these briefly real quick and then I think... Um, I'm gonna make maybe like a quest, um, a quest, easy quest lab setup to where my makes my quests easier to to do. Um, and just do maybe a little speed run of me doing quests. But anyway, so let's go over the gold first. Now, um, let's go ahead and look at where my gold says it's at right now. It has a temporary boost. I don't really know why. But it looks like my temporary boost is at six times six hundred and fifty point point four for my gold. So what happens if I just literally buy this one time? Literally let's see, let's see how much it goes up. So actually it went up like point six of a percent, I think. That's actually not bad. But um, not much. We went to when we went up 0.6 of times gold. So this one doesn't help that much, I don't think. Maybe if you're still a little bit early on in the game, it might help you a little bit. I would put just a little bit, but they do start getting pretty expensive. So um, that's why this one's so much lower. Now over here, uh, this is the one I've been focusing on recently because I'm kind of getting to the point where I want to get a lot of quests done, and um, I think this is a, one of the best ways to make money is the shiny score so I've been like really plugging it into this on the wall so my shiny score is 1 in 136.5 right now um, speaking of which um, I'm gonna go spend this hundred trillion dollars real quick on the shiny wall because I've been saving up for this might as well put it on a video you yeah. uh, know let's see all right hundred trillion dollars this is the most expensive upgrade I've ever done in my entire career but we're going for it bam it just went up to 150 trillion dollars well thanks mom oh gosh what did that even do for me it's still like 100 point 136 136 chance of a shiny still after 100 trillion dollars spent oh well that's why i'm also using this one to you know upgrade it Plus, um, there's an upgrade in the Rebirth Room that allows your pet score to boost your shiny chance. So, um, getting 10 million, that was another reason why I wanted to get up so high is because, or at least to the 10 million, is so that I could start getting more shinies through that, that method as well. <clears throat> Alright, so Metallic Luck. Very, very crucial. Honestly, guys, this is like, if you invest in this early, you're not going to be mad. Because then you're going to start getting this those metallics pretty quickly um i was at a certain point in the game where i was already kind of getting metallics my metallic chance was already up quite a bit and actually i think i had it maxed for the game before the update for the mine went through so i just hadn't worked on them for very long but 
Um, that's a very good one to be putting stuff into at the at start because you want to get that metallic chance up. And the upgrades, honestly, they're not bad. Like compared to this pedestal over here where you use rebirth stones, like these aren't that bad and expensive. They give you quite a bit of boost just for a little bit. Um, I put a lot. Um, this is where I was really putting a lot of my my stone or my runes at first is the egg luck. And uh, so that's up to 6%. Um, I honestly don't know how high it goes. But now it's super expensive, so I can't freaking... I can't even. I can't even. All right, so let's go ahead and go over here and start mining. Um, what are we going to do? Oh, yes, yeah, so we're going to make a new build here. Which one do I want to use? Probably this one. Yeah. All right, let's reset this one. Ugh. So obviously when we're doing quests, we want to be able to make a lot of money. So we're going to probably obviously do this, and this, more of this, and then obviously here's quest luck, and there's quest difficulty, so I'm going to get both of those. And then here's more quest luck up here. I think that's all you can really get in the game right now. <clears throat> that's the max quest luck. Uh, but let's keep going. So we need five more in this category. So let's put it into that. Now this one's super good, I think. Gives a multiplier based off of which quest area you have. And then here's more quest difficulty. We're gonna bring that down. Okay. And then here we're probably just gonna put it into the money, right? Should I put it in the money or should I put it into like this? I'm thinking I should put it maybe into this. I kind of want to also boost my exotic score. I don't know. What do you guys? Uh, you guys should let me know. Think what you guys. Is, what, what do you guys is thinking better? Which is better? Because this gives you point one point five percent gold bonus, which I don't think that's really that great compared to all my other bonuses based off my shiny score. Because my shiny score gives me like. Time, it gives me like 3,000% extra gold, so what's an extra 1% gold? So yeah, we're definitely going to put it into this. I think that's my thinking there. And then, I want to make my pets a little bit faster than everybody else's, hopefully. So let's put 5 into the speed for the pets. So that'll help them run around, break, break stuff, and make money faster. And they can also switch zones faster, too when I switch them from different zones uh, or different areas, whatever it's called. Now this next one here, we are most likely going to keep going in, into this direction. With that, let's put five into here. There we go. Alright, as it continues, looks like we really only... My phone is dying, that's not good. Hold on, I'm going to go buy the charger. Gosh, I can't see the screen. Alright, we are on our charger now, so let's go ahead and continue. So we only have seven left. What am I thinking here? Because I think once you get up here, they give you more bonus per upgrade for that one. I mean, generally, that's how it works anyways with all the upgrades. Because if you look at here, this gives you plus one. This one up here gives you plus 1.2 per upgrade. And that happens with the speed too. Because there's 10 speed here. And then these ones give you less. So they plus 3, plus 2, plus 3. This one gives you plus 4 per upgrade. Yeah. So I don't know if I should go for more speed or if I should go for more upgrade chance. My guys aren't one shotting that much. Honestly, maybe I should put some into damage. I don't know. Let's see how much of the damage really helps me, because I'm at, well, wow. <laughs> With my new giant, actually my giant damage is almost at 2 million. So right now it's at 50, uh, 1956955. Okay. Let's see if I can remember that. So it's like right under 57,000. Oh, we got a quest in. And I guess, yeah, while we're working on this, we'll be switching stuff too. 
Did this actually... Oh no, I don't have the quest thing activated yet, dang it. I'm still on my other build. Uh, but anyways, let's continue here. So let's go ahead and, so this one gives us plus four, plus three. What does one do for me? Four percent. Why did it not go up? It literally didn't even go up. It's the exact same number. What the heck? Oh, yeah, because I don't have it activated. I'm stupid. Let's go ahead and just activate it. Jeez. All right, now it should go up. Didn't go up. <laughs> what the heck? Is it active? What did I just do? Okay, yeah, no, this is right. It should be. It should have gave me my damage boost. All right, well, the damage boost sucks, apparently. Not doing that. That's a complete flub. Um, so, my, my thinking is, to help me with the quest, is there anything quest-specific anymore that I'm not seeing here? I don't think so. I think I've gotten all the quest stuff, so I just need to make money now. Alright. Huh. I think I'm actually going to put them here. Max that out, and then put one in there. <laughs> there we go. All right, let's check out our stats now. So, exotic luck is up to 20.77. And drop rate's at 259. Damage at almost 600%. And my gold is 670 times more. Okay, plus luck, 37%. So one third of all my quests will go through as another quest. That's cool. <laughs> But then quest difficulty minus 65% and pet speed 220. So I'm going to probably pause the video and then kind of just do a little bit of a rewards grab real quick. And then we can spend them all. Um, so yeah. Oh, and also real quick, I forgot to mention. So yeah, since I activated that after I got this quest, the quest is no longer, is not like affected by the lab so you have to keep that in mind when you're doing this too um but yeah all right got this one done we're going for that quest luck bam dang it oh i got it i was like what dang it and all right let's go for these guys in the jungle let's go have these savage animals just rip this jungle apart No quest luck there, unfortunately. Oh, got a pen strike. Nothing. All right, here we go. Got some quest luck. Nice. All right. Let's go put guys in the jungle. Oh, and I also wanted to point this out real quick. Um, my strongest pet now is a mythical, which is definitely weird to me now, but that's sick. I. I've always wanted the mythicals to be the strongest ones in the, in the game, so that's cool.